Welcome to the 2016 Google Play Awards. Please welcome Purnima Kochikar, Head of Apps and Games BD, Google Play. Good evening. How's everyone doing? Welcome to the first ever Google Play Awards. Since we announced this program about a couple weeks ago, there has been incredible excitement from the developer community and the press from all around the world. This would not be possible without you and your work. So give yourself a big round of applause. Looking back at how much we have accomplished together since, the, since we launched Google Play, it's pretty amazing. And the momentum isn't letting up. Your apps and games now reach a billion users every month through Play, and they're driving 65 billion downloads in 2015 alone. Pretty amazing, isn't it? Each day, my team and I have the privilege of working with you to help you build successful mobile businesses. And each day, you use the platforms and tools we provide to create apps and games that amaze and inspire us. Tonight, we take the time to celebrate you and the great work you have done over the last year. Tonight, we honor 10 examples of outstanding achievement. So, let's get the show started, shall we? All right. Out Indie. Please welcome Bob Meese, Head of Games BD, Google Play. Hi everyone. This is a, a lot of fun. What a great crowd tonight. Thank you. All right. So Indies provide fun, deep, and meaningful experiences spanning games of all genres. They prove that developers of any size can succeed on Android. I judged the first Google Play Indie Festival last month, and it reminded me how much I love games in the games industry. We're thrilled to support this community, and it's so important to us. We have the Indie Corner, which we recently launched, which is a dedicated collection of indie games that we promote on the Play Store. Let's look at the nominees. Standout indie nominees are Alpha Bear, Alto's Adventure, Fast Like a Fox. Nico Atsume, Kitty Collector. Standout Indie. All right, are you ready? The winner of the first ever Google Play Award is Alpha Bear. Best 
use of Google Play game services. All right, for the next award. So Google Play game services fuel increased competition on Google Play that help create a great community of gamers. With features like multiplayer and leaderboards, they help keep gamers engaged and keep them coming back for more. All of the nominees in this category integrated multiple Google Play game features that enhance the overall user experience. Let's take a look at the nominees. Best use of Google Play game services nominees are Sea Battle 2, Table Tennis Touch, Tap Ventures. Power Madness 2. Zombie Highway 2. Best use of Google Play game services. All right. For the next one, applause for all the nominees. All right, cool. And the winner is Table Tennis Touch. use of material design. Please welcome Larissa Fontaine, Head of Apps BD, Google Play. So having recently finished a home improvement project, I used even more new apps than I usually do, which is kind of a lot. And it was incredible that with the adoption of material design, how quickly I was able to navigate and find recommendations and ideas in well-designed apps. They were enjoyable, intuitive, and helped me find exactly what I was looking for without having to hunt and peck. And it's not just home improvement apps. Over one million apps have adopted material design elements in just the last two years since we announced them. This year's nominees represent first-class material design implementations across many categories. And the nominees are... Best use of material design nominees are... Bring. Fabulous. Robin Hood. To Doist. Vivo. Best use of material design. And the winner is. Robin Hood.
startup. I'm, st I'm still here. <laughs> Similar to our focus on indies, this year we're putting startup developers front and center. And as we've talked about a couple times over the last two days, we've launched an early access program for apps that are still in beta to connect developers with a community of early adopters to get great feedback early in your development. We are consistently amazed with the incredible funnel of fresh and unique experiences coming from lean teams. And this group of nominees represent incredible startups from across the ecosystem. And the nominees are... Standout startup nominees are... Dub Smash. Hopper. Musically, Robin Hood, Verse, Standout Startup, and the winner is. Hopper. Best Families App. Please welcome Ben Galbraith, Head of Developer Relations, Developer Product Group. Last May, we launched a dedicated family section in the Play Store. We did this to help developers surface their apps and games to parents and to provide a unique discovery experience based on age and popular characters. As the father of eight young children, all one wife, all one at a time, this section <laughs> is enormously popular in our household. We love these apps. Let's take a look at the nominees. Best Families app nominees are Card Wars Adventure Time, Lego Jurassic World. My Very Hungry Caterpillar. Think Rolls 2. Toka Nature. Best Families App. And the winner is... Think Rolls 2. Most Innovative. The most innovative category highlights the apps and games that bring the wow moments, that demonstrate something truly new and unique. 
Now this could, form, this could come in the form of new controls for a game based on the latest sensors, or it could be deep personalization that gives you an intimate emotional connection to the experience. In whatever form it comes, innovation can transform something ordinary into something immersive all on a mobile device that fits in the palm of your hand. And the nominees are? Most innovative nominees are Fabulous Fast Like a Fox New York Times VR Smart News This War of Mine Most Innovative The winner is New York Times VR <laughs> Adopter. Please welcome Samir Samat, VP, Product Management, Google Play. I, I'm, I'm, I'm only realizing now that many of you did not get the memo on the appropriate dress code for this evening's attire, uh, and, and you're forgiven, however. Uh, but I wanted to look my best in honor of some of the greatest developers in the world. Uh, and, and <laughs> one, of my, one of the favorite parts of my job is watching developers take a new design or a nascent technology and create experiences that are truly changing people's lives. The apps and the games that they create offer a service, piece of functionality, or an entirely new experience that is truly inspiring and amazing. Being an early adopter is really hard. It means challenging the status quo. It means pushing your team in different directions. These are all things that we at Google truly admire in this year's nominees. Let's take a look. Early adopter nominees are Glide. Escape Minecraft Story Mode World Around Me Sumper Adopter. And the winner this year in the early adopter category is World Around Me. Global. 
Given how popular Android devices are around the world, we often get asked by developers, how do I make a successful entrance into a new market? And many people think that localizing an app just means taking the app from one language to another. But it's so much more than that. For an app to feel truly successful in a different country, users there need to believe that it was built for them. This is all about colors and character choices and contextual relevance as well as language. It's really hard to do. And so this year we wanted to honor a set of developers that exemplify what great localization looks like. And the nominees are, let's take a look. Go Global nominees are Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. Freeletics Bodyweight. Memrise. Music Smash. Pokemon Shuffle Mobile. Go Global. And the winner this year in the Go Global category Pokemon Shuffle Mobile. Welcome, Jamie Rosenberg, VP, Google Play. Hi, everyone. It's incredibly humbling, just looking out at this room, it's incredibly humbling as a reminder to see how far our Android developer community has come since we first launched the platform back in 2008. We're now at the final two award categories of the night, best app, and best game. The nominees in these categories are true examples of the amazing work being done by all of you and our Android developers all over the world. First, the award for best app. Whether you're looking for a recipe, ideas for a home remodel, or ways to stay informed or entertained, the nominees in this category make your day more productive and more fun. They serve their users in different ways, but what they all have in common is great design, intuitive user experience, and broad appeal. Let's take a look at the nominees for Best App. Best App nominees are BuzzFeed News, Colorfy, House. Radio. Yummy. Best app. And the winner of the award for best app is House.
Best game. I'll have to try that one at home later. <laughs> so this year's nominees for best game give everyone a reason to be a gamer. From big screen characters to small screen heroes, from puzzles to clans to battles. These nominees connect and delight users everywhere and they're also a ton of fun. They also tend to showcase the very best of what an Android device can do. So let's take a look at the nominees for best game. Best game nominees are Alpha Bear, Clash of Kings, Clash Royale. Marvel Future Fight. Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. Best Game. And the winner of the Google Play Award for Best Game is Clash Royale. <laughs> Welcome back to the stage, Purnima Kochikar. All right, one more huge round of applause for all the nominees and the winners, please. Make some noise. With so many amazing apps and games, it was an extremely difficult task for the panel to pick the nominees and the winners. Thank you for constantly pushing the boundaries to show us what's possible. I hope you had a good time tonight. Oh. And I hope you're energized to go out and use the new tools and features that we announced all through IO to create new apps and games. <laughs> My team and I are eagerly waiting to see what you will create next. It's constantly, we are constantly amazed and it's what makes our jobs fun every day. But first, it's time to go out and have some fun. Please join us for after hours happening all around the venue. Good night and thank you. <laughs> <laughs>